Hi guys, how are you doing? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Cecilia Kasiku Namakasa. Thank you so much to all the new subscribers for joining the team. If you have been here sticking around, thank you very much as well. I really, really appreciate you. Thank you for always making sure that you watch my videos and you give me thumbs up. Well, welcome to yet another exciting episode of learn basic portuguese with cecilia last time i took you through the greetings on how to speak about um yourself what your name is you know how you can greet when you meet somebody new and all that how to say good morning good afternoon and good evening if you haven't watched that video please do go back to my channel and look for it that is our first episode of learn portuguese with Cecilia. Without wasting time, let's get into the video. Today, I do not want to make this video long because I don't want to bore you with a lot of information. And at the end of the day, you don't learn anything. So I'm making it very short and sweet, straight to the point. So I'll be talking about two things or I'll be covering two things in this video. The first one, the edge, and the second one, the profession. So I will be teaching you how to talk about your age, how to talk about your profession or where you work in Portuguese. Are you ready? All right. Vamos começar. Let's start. The first thing is the age. So if somebody asks you for your age, you they would say quantos anos tens or que idade tens? Okay, I'm going to repeat that again. If somebody has to ask you for your age in Portuguese, they would say, Quantos anos tens? Or, Que idade tens? That simply means, How old are you? Okay, now I'm going to be pinning, um, what do you call it, a link in the description so that you can go there and learn the numbers. So I'm not going to be dwelling on all the numbers, telling you all the numbers, what they are in Portuguese. And if somebody asks you, quantos anos tens? How old are you? Okay, dad tens. How old are you? How do you respond to that? You'd respond by saying, tenho 30 anos. Note that I've placed eu in brackets. That's because you don't necessarily have to say eu all the time. So tenho 30 anos de Idad. You can also note that I've placed the idad in brackets. That is because you don't necessarily have to say it. That simply says I am 30 of age or 30 years old. Oh. Professors. Professors simply means professions. So again, I'm going to be pinning down um, a website or a link that you can follow for you to see all the professions, what the names of the professions are in Portuguese. I'm on, only going to be talking about a few examples. So, professions is professions. If somebody asks you, qual est a tua profession? Qual est a tua profession? What is your profession? So, to respond to this, you'd say, eu sou médico or eu sou médica. Again, in Portuguese, it's all about gender you know, femininity and masculinity. So that means that if you say so medica is because you are female. So because I'm a girl, I'd say also medica. If you are a, a guy, you'd say also medical. So you might be asking yourself, what is medica? What is medical? This is a doctor. If you are a doctor in Portuguese, it is medical or I know that there are certain people that would say doutor or doutora, but mostly doutor or doutora is, is the title itself. But, you know, the profession itself is medical or medica. Or you'd say also enfermeira for a nurse, a female nurse, enfermeiro for a male nurse. Now, from this, you have noted that the gender plays a role. But this is not for all profession. There are some professions that are an exception, that no matter 
or it doesn't matter whether it's female or male, it will still remain the same. Professions such as contabilista, that is an accountant, there is no contabilisto. Contabilista is just contabilista, so it doesn't change. I'll be pinning down the link that you can follow to check out all these professions. Or somebody might ask you, instead of asking you, qual est ta profession, they might ask you, on the travalia. Where do you work? Eu trabalho no hospital. I work in the hospital. So, enfermeira. I am a nurse. Trabalho numa escola secundária. I work in a secondary school. So, professora de português. I am a Portuguese teacher, for example. That is all for today, guys. So, it's the edge and the profession. Quantos anos tens? Que idade tens? How old are you? Tenho 30 anos de idade. I am 30 years old, for example. Qual é a tua profissão? Sou enfermeira. I am a nurse. So, guys, I hope that you have learned something from this video. Até a próxima vez. Beijinhos. Segundo para roubar um sorriso bonito do teu perfeito rosto é só no segundo. Dá-me um minuto.